In this video, I'll show you how to set up the view panes uh, and pages associated with organic groups. There's three of them that we're going to set up. One is the AUG members, which is a list of the most recent members in the group. The second is the AUG list, which lists all the public groups as well as private groups that you're a member of. And the third is AUG user groups, which shows all of the groups of the currently logged in user. In order to do this, we're going to need a couple more modules. The first is Chaos Tools which can be found at drupal.org slash project slash ctools and views, which can be found at drupal.org slash project slash views. Once those are installed, we're going to enable chaos tools, views content panes, views, and views UI. The first view pane we're going to configure is the AUG members. In order to do that, we're going to go to Structure, Views, and we'll edit the view, Aug Members. And there's actually not much we need to do here. If you leave it as is, it'll work just fine. But there are a couple of things that you might want to change. For example, we could give the title so that instead of it saying Aug Members, it'll say Recent Members of percent one. Now this percent one is actually a placeholder, it'll replace the group name in there. So for example, group number one, it'll say recent members of group number one. So I'm going to apply that. The other thing that you might want to change here is the number of people that are displayed. You can do this a couple of ways. Either you can use a pager, such as a mini pager, uh, and five would be fine or you can just change the number uh, to something like 10, maybe most recent 10 members. I'm okay with that, so I'll go ahead and just save it. And just to let you know, we're actually gonna display this in the next video, group layout. So we'll just move on to our next view now. We'll go back to views, I'm going to structure, views. And this time I'm gonna edit the aug list view. This is what lists all of the public groups and private groups that you're a member of on the site. And as you can see, this view is already set up for us as well at the path group list. So if we type that in the URL bar, we can see what that looks like. Since we just have the first group on here, all we see is group number one. I'm gonna go ahead and go back because for this video, I'm gonna go ahead and add a menu item I'm just going to make it a normal menu entry and call it all groups. I'm going to put it in the main menu and apply. Now I'll go ahead and save this. And we'll move on to our last view. We'll go back to structure views once again. We're going to scroll down to the AUG user groups. Again, this is already set up with a path at user dash groups. So we can see what that looks like. And I'm only in the one group because there's only one on the site, so that's all it's listed. When we add more groups later, more groups that I'm a member of will show up here. I'll go ahead and go back because I'm also going to add a menu item for this. Call it my groups. Put it in the main menu and apply. Save. And if we want to go home, we can see that we now have the menus for all groups and my groups.